The insert into statement is used to insert a new row in a table. If we want to insert a new row into our department's table we can use one of the following SQL statements. When adding a new row, we should ensure the dated type of the value in the column matches. We have to follow the integrity constraints if any defined for the table. When adding a row only the characters or date values should be enclosed with single quotes. While inserting the row if we are adding value for all the columns of the table we need not specify the column's name in the SQL query. But we need to make sure the order of the values is in the same order as the columns in the table. If we don't define the columns and use only the simplified version then we must populate all columns. It is also possible to only add data in specific columns. We cannot omit inserting data into the column, which is declared as primary key or is declared with not null option.